Are y'all ready? It is officially week two, day one, 30 day booty pump challenge. First workout of the week and let's get it. I'm gonna start with some glute alterations and then we'll get into the workout. I just finished my glute activation workout and I'm ready to get into this workout and yeah hope you're ready and we're gonna put off with our donkey kicks on both sides moving on to leg circles get it right in tight of course hit your fire hydrants some sumo squats and kick it off with some jumping lunges and yes those are killer Um, I'm about to work out. It is the day three, second workout of the booty pump challenge, and I'm super excited. Today is hit, so hopefully I don't die. But let's get into it. I'm about to just work out. Then I'm gonna figure out what my afternoon after workout snack is gonna be. And yeah, my right now I'm just gonna pour myself some water and relax before I work out. I'm about to start, hit workout. I'm actually literally sweating. Or maybe it's just my moisturizer. That was great. Even though I'm like obviously exhausted, I don't feel as dead as I did for last week's workout. I actually did all the workouts this time. All the seconds, like every set, whatever. And I don't feel as bad. I'm even doing like the jumping squats. My glutes weren't in as much pain as I thought they would be. So that's a good sign. I feel great. I'm excited to work on my abs. I haven't worked on my abs in almost a month. But yeah, I'm, I feel good. My skin looks nice right here. This is amazing lighting. I'm like right under my window. This is great. I just finished the ab workout. That was freaking great. I'm gonna go downstairs and make food. Hey. Okay. So I really wasn't that hungry for my workout because I think my breakfast was so big today. But I just cut up. I mean, I just grilled up two little veggie burgers. So they're soy patties with spinach and chard. Um, one patty has nine grams of protein, which isn't a lot, but I'm having two patties, so that's almost 20 grams of protein. Not bad. Yes. I'm eating my veggie burger, standing up in my kitchen because I want to. But I feel good. That up workout 
it was amazing it, like i actually really felt it if you don't know what a vacuum is which is what i was which which is what i did after every workout um i'm gonna link down below the like the ab workout and then i'm also gonna link down her video where she talks about vacuums and how you do it and all that and the benefits so yeah Hey guys, it is December 5th. Uh, I'm whispering a little bit because Ella just fell asleep. And if I'm loud when she just falls asleep, she's most likely gonna wake up. Today I had tofu scramble and potatoes for breakfast. That's literally the same thing I've been eating every day for breakfast for almost a week now. <laughs> but, but yeah, let's get into this workout. Um, you guys have obviously already seen this workout. For the first day I did it, so we're just gonna speed through this. I don't know if I'm gonna talk with between sets. We'll see how I'm feeling. So I'm gonna start with my glute activation routine, and then I'm gonna get. So why do a workout that isn't benefiting me? So I decided to set them and do jumping squats. This last set been killing me, but last set gonna get my booty like. It's always the last set that gets your booty like. How's it gonna get it? It's gonna be like. My glute bottom, the bottom of my butt, the bottom of my butt is killing me. And I know I only show myself doing it two times, I think. Yeah, I only show myself doing it two times, but I did do, I did it three times. It's just, I don't like putting in a bunch of like speed clips of me working out, which you're going to see me repeat again on another day anyway. Like you don't even see, you don't even you don't need to see me doing the same workout three times in a row with a random background music. Like, I feel like it's kind of annoying, so I just decided to put one to two sets of each workout that I do into the video and just be through it. Um, because, yeah. But just know that for the best results and for the best workout, I recommend you repeat this workout three times. So I just finished. My third day of this week's workout, which was the uh, glute workout for week two, and I'm feeling great. My glutes feel it, but I'm feeling good. I'm making the same veggie burgers I had yesterday because they're so good, and I have a bunch of them, so why not? Um, I'm just going to eat, hang out. I'm going to shower as soon as she wakes up because I need to. Hey guys, it is officially the last workout day of this week. Yesterday was rest day. Um, I felt great yesterday. Wasn't as sore as I thought I'd be, but this morning I woke up and my glutes definitely felt it. And like my upper body was kind of like, I, think, I don't know if it was from like the hit workout or from the abs, but I don't know. It's one o'clock and all I've ate was a few french fries and a coffee. And this is about to be like my third salsa water. Bad. Don't do what I do. But I'll eat a real meal after. So, yeah. Let's get into this hit. I'm going to put my hair up. And let's do it. 
I found a Heather Robertson cardio and ab workout. So I'm gonna do like a two in one workout. I've honestly never done this workout before and I've done a lot of hers. So this should be interesting, but yes. Follow along as usual, everything will be linked below. And let's get into it. Secret one, done. We're kind of done with the hit workout, but now we're going on to the floor to do some abs. Circuit. I'm moving on. Now it's time for hit workout number two. Quads, my quads are feeling it right now. <laughs> All right, that was the second hit workout sesh, whatever. Um, now we're on to. The last two sets, which is back to abs. So I'm gonna put you back on the floor. And someone just ate. So that was me running around, went to go get her food, went to feed her. I mean, she feeds herself and then I just clean up after her. So now she's just gonna be running around. All right, I tried getting rid of the awkward sun coming in right here. I did the best I could. You gonna join me? Because, you ready? So I actually did make a whole outro for this workout this day and this video, but I lost it. So moving on. This workout was amazing. Uh, like I said, I'm going to link everything down below. It was a great workout. My abs were feeling it. The hit, like, it was just a great workout. It was actually in total a 48-minute workout. I only completed 42 minutes of it. D kind of due to Ella waking up and I was able to work out for almost like uh 20 minutes with her there like I don't you, you guys I didn't show this but she woke up I went and like I fed her lunchtime because it was lunchtime for her thank you but yeah it was kind of due to her waking up and mainly it was due to her wanting attention she could deal with it for a while like working out next to me and like jumping around but after a while she's like no like mommy I want you I want to play so I was like all right well I did like 42 minutes and that's good enough for me so hold on baby so that is the reason why it kind of like abruptly ended I don't even know if I'm saying that word right Talk about week two it was great um, I did start in getting, I have, I did start getting more sore in like the glute area and my body definitely was feeling like my entire body was definitely feeling more sore from doing the hits and then having a rest day. Like I stated before, I definitely learned the importance of rest days in this challenge so far and how they are actually very good for your body. Thank you, baby. All right. 
yeah so far so good I'm feeling great today is actually day one of week three I'm going to be doing the glute workout today my endurance is definitely higher than before my body is definitely slimming down I think um I do need to eat a little bit more. I've realized that I haven't been eating as much lately. Or at least I haven't been eating as much to keep up with the workouts I've been doing. Week two was amazing. We're halfway there. The first two weeks was great. I'm already seeing nice results. So I'm super excited to get to the end of this. And I love you guys. Don't forget to comment, like, if you are doing this along with me. Please, please, please comment down below. Let me know how you're doing. Let me know if you can help me, if I can help you, if we can do this together. Um, and yeah, 